Cindy, welcome to the second episode of Brainsplain. Thank you. One of these three theories doesn't work for depression. Okay. SSRI medications, serotonin-focused medications. Mm -hmm. Electroconvulsive therapy, where they put so much brain, electricity through somebody's brain that they have a seizure. Mm -hmm. And cr transcranial um, electrical stimulation, where they put a small current through somebody's brain, not enough that they have a seizure. Okay. So which of those do you think doesn't work? Uh, the transmitter in the brain. The transmitter, well, it's a small amount of current they pass through the brain, but okay. I think you were on to me. Yeah. That's the right one, yes. Okay. So what do you know about therapies that do work for mental health, for depression? I worked in marketing for neurosciences, so oh, I, cool. I'm fairly familiar. I have a Google medical degree, <laughs> so um, so I, I know that the their research is still going on, the field is being studied, um, they're, you know, medication approaches to depression is, you know, does create a statistically significant impact, but not what we would obviously like to see in the field of research. I would agree with all of that. Okay. And it turns out with this one thing called um, cranial electrical stimulation, they've been putting electricity in through people's brains in low doses for 2,000 years. I a, did not know that. A doctor called Galen okay. used to put electrical fish on people's heads. More recently, this, and, <laughs> and a, who knows if that worked. Right. <laughs> and the Soviet Union's been really intensely researching this for sleep. Okay. So more recently, people have set up little companies that charge $1,000 for the equivalent of a 9-volt battery that will, with little electrodes, pass a tiny current through somebody's head. Okay. And this has been studied, all the studies up through 2014 didn't really hit the nail on the head. Um, in terms of how they were done. The samples were so small and the, the sham placebo medications didn't trick people well enough into thinking they were getting anything. Okay. So 2015, uh, one article in 2014 and two articles in 2015 really kind of show that if there's any difference at all between placebo and this CET, cranial electrical stimulation, it's very, very small. Okay. 66 people. Um, in total were enrolled and it did not seem to help them. Got it. Um, don't spend a thousand dollars on one of these devices <laughs> is my advice to Batteries you. Batteries are available for cheaper. <laughs> Batteries are available for cheaper, absolutely.